guys, it's me again. I thought I would do how to make Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards slime or Kids Sports Awards slime. This comes from a Pinterest user that spirited it out. For every five pounds of flour, you'll need four large boxes of vanilla pudding, eight cups or half a gallon of water, and then something to mess it into. So let's get started. Reason I'm doing this is I'm doing a 100 video. And I've already tried this once last year. So. Oh. Soft flour. And this makes one to two gallons. You can double this to make three to four if you wanted to. So I whole get a whole gallon of water. And then the guy says add food coloring. I decided to go with icing dye because it'll make it look better. Baby shampoo, so I ordered a one ounce bottle because I have one ounce of icing coloring. Yeah, I should put it in afterwards. Now, if I had some bananas right about now, which I don't. I would turn this into banana pudding. Slime. Maybe I'll do that next year. And some vanilla wipers. I'll take out the trash after I get done with this, but pretty much it needs to be mixed together. The last time I tried this, I used one of these and it went fucking everywhere. So this time, I'm going to do it without one of those. It says you need a paint master tool. So I got the next best thing. A uh, oh, the blend up icing when you color it. It's about, yeah, this is a 10 gallon bucket and it makes about two gallons. So this guy said mix until all the mixture is.
pretty much together. Alright, so I'm going to add another half a gallon of water. I knew that I would need to do this, so... Because this is, uh, not going to work. He said make sure you get all the lumps out of it, so I might do so. Man, this is like bacon and cake. Holy crap. Big damn cake. There's still a lot of flour at the bottom. Let's see. I'm going to actually switch over to a spoon. It's pretty big. Pull the flour out of the bottom. I busted my cuticle on my thumbnail. Alright, so it's starting to look like a big damn thing of cake batter. And now I'm taking both spoons. Trying to get that flower at the bottom. Yeah, 
There we go. I might leave both of these in here that I like to stir in the uh, food coloring and the uh, other thing. I'm going to get this out of the way. But I'm going to let this refrigerate for a couple hours. And then I'll put the green food coloring in it. And I'll see you guys later. Man, that's a lot of sun. You want to want to help me get sun? Hey guys, it's me again. I thought I would do how to make Nickelodeon Kids Choice Award slime or Kids Sports Award slime. This comes from a Pinterest user that's figured it out. For every five pounds of flour, you'll need four large bosses of vanilla pudding, eight cups or half a gallon of water, and then something to mix it into. So let's get started. Reason I'm doing this is I'm doing a 100 video, and I've already tried this once last year, so. Oh. It's a lot of flour. And this makes one to two gallons. You could double this to make three to four if you wanted to. So a whole, get a whole gallon of water. And then the guy says, add food coloring. I decided to go with icing dye because it'll make it look better. And baby shampoo, so I ordered a one ounce bottle because I have one ounce of icing coloring. Yeah, I should put it in afterwards. Now, if I had some bananas right about now, which I don't, I would turn this into banana pudding. Slime. Maybe I'll do that next year. And some vanilla wipers. Now I'll take out the trash after I get done with this, but pretty much it needs to be mixed together. The last time I tried this, I used one of these and it went fucking everywhere. So this time, I'm going to do it without one of those. Says you need a paint master tool. So I'm 
So I got the next best thing. Hey, uh. Pull the plane up. I sing when you tar it. That makes about, yeah, this is a 10 gallon bucket and it makes about, two gallons. So this guy said mix until all the menstruates. Pretty much together. Alright, so I'm going to add another half a gallon of water. I knew that I would need to do this, so. Because this is, uh, not going to work. Alright, there we go. He said make sure you get all the lumps out of it, so I'm going to do so. Man, this is like bacon and cake. Holy crap. Big damn cake. Oh man. All right, so. There's still a lot of flour at the bottom. Let's see. I'm gonna actually switch over to a spoon that's pretty big. Pull the flour out of the bottom. Uh. I'm 
busted my cuticle on my thumbnail. Or that little red area. Alright, so it's starting to look like a big damn thing of cake batter. And now I'm taking both spoons. And trying to get that flour at the bottom. I'm going to leave both of these in here that I can stir in the uh, food coloring and the uh, other thing. I'm going to get this out of the way. But I'm going to let this refrigerate for a couple hours. And then I'll put the green food coloring in it. And I'll see you guys later. Man, that's a lot of sun. You wanna wanna help me get signed? Hey guys, it's me again. I wanted to let you know that I'm still working on the sign right here, right in front of me. That's a lot of sun. And I doubled the water amount. I've also added homemade contact solution to it, so it's actually the consistency of what Nickelodeon uses. And I put over eight cups of salt water into it, so Let me take the camera real quick. Hopefully I won't drop it. There you go. So this is part two. And part three will be the actual slimming. So I'll see you guys probably in the next couple of days. Hey guys, it's me again. Uh, got the song ready, so I'm gonna actually kind of stir it up a little bit. Guys, it's been sitting here for a few hours. And it looks like real. Put about uh, almost a gallon of salt water into it or saline. And I'm going to actually cover myself up because I think this is a little cold. I've ordered some really huge cakes, so I'm only going to use this one. Because this shit's going to go far and everywhere. Okay. 
I was going to call it down, but I decided not to. The next one is a really big all-purpose cake that I decided to use. These are actually from Cricut, a company up in Pennsylvania. And this was really loud, but it's uh, waterproof as a layer. And this one's really long. It goes all the way down past my knees, which I just had knee surgery last year or year before last. So Probably wondering how in the hell I'm gonna stop the video. I'm just gonna let it go and I'll stop it once I get out of the shower and then I'll cut the uh, end of it off or I'll just leave it unedited. And this will really look good together. Plus, I'm actually wearing a back load underneath. I would put some kind of protection on top of this, but I don't need it. And just to make sure it doesn't go flying out of the shower, because I've had that happen before. And I'm going to scoot back. If you're wondering how much this one was, it's about 28 bucks, so it should hold up. I decided to take the shower thing out. That way I can put the camera up. So glasses are actually going to be kind of over here, out of the way. And I thought about actually grabbing a gallon of milk jug and do it that way, but nah. And by the way, this is like a Metro Mega all purpose. It's thick. Oh. Hopefully it does not dye my hair, but I'll rinse it out when it does. Oh, oh crap. Oh. And that's why you wear, you know, to catch it all. Oh my god, it went everywhere. Oh. Damn. 
down here. Seven. Oh, man. Got it smell clear. Okay. We're really kind of first in the show. Went through. And it's went everywhere else. Oh. oh, thanks for watching. in the old days in Nickelodeon, uh, let me turn the shower off, there used to be a show called What Would You Do? And I wanted to come out with the Pie Pod and the Pie Washments together, kind of, because I never went to 
the big old industrial here is Orlando, Florida. So I might open up the Kickstarter program and create one that spins on a motor of some sort and completely gets you, you know, messy and wet. Let me know what you think about that. All right, so I think that's it. Uh, I'll wash off afterwards. Ah, just a little bit. I got a little spill right here, so.